Hi there, I'm Claire from EnglishAtHome.com. In today's pronunciation video, I want to look at some th words which can be hard to say. So the th sound can be difficult to pronounce. Remember, you need to put your tongue between your teeth, th. You don't need to put it a long way between your teeth, so you don't need to go th, but just a little way. So th, th. And the th sound can be harder to say when it's combined with other sounds. So in this video, I've got a few examples of some of those words and some easy ways to help you pronounce it correctly. With s. An example of this is the word maths. Maths. Your tongue has to go from a th to a s sound, and your tongue's going to go back in your mouth. Maths. Maths. Can you feel that your tongue will go back from th, th, maths? Other examples of the th with a s sound is this these, those, with the F sound. So an example of a word where you have a th and then a th is the word fifth, fifth. And this word is difficult because you're going from a th, which is where your teeth are just above your lip, th, to a th sound where your tongue is between your teeth. And the trick with this word is to try and pronounce it quickly. So don't stop on every sound, fifth, th, otherwise it's impossible. But try and go a little bit more quickly, fifth, fifth. And it's easier if you practice it a lot, fifth, fifth, with a T. So some examples of where you have a th with a t are in the numbers 13 and 30, 13, 30. And for this, your tongue has to travel from between your teeth, th, to a t sound where your tongue touches the top of your mouth, 13, 30, 13, 30. And then you also have the numbers 13th and 30th. And here, your tongue then goes from your between your teeth to the top of your mouth, and then back to between your teeth again. Thirteenth, thirtieth, thirteenth, thirtieth, with R. So some examples of where you have a th and a r sound are thrive, thrive, through through, thrifty, thrifty, and thrilling, thrilling. Now, these sounds, the th and the r, are difficult because your tongue goes from a th between the teeth to change the shape to make a r sound. And a r is a sound that comes from the back of your mouth, r. So together you've got thr, thr. Do you feel that your tongue is changing its shape a little bit? Thra, thra. Okay, and a couple more words which often cause problems are although, where you go from a l to a the, although, and then also the word Thursday. Don't confuse it with Tuesday, it's Thursday. Okay, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and you can subscribe by clicking that button there because every week I publish a new video. And if you would like extra help with your English, then you can sign up to my email group and the link's up there because every week I send you an email with extra help for English speaking, vocabulary, grammar and pronunciation. Thanks for watching. Bye.